People got no manners at them daggum buffets. There was a guy actually sitting at the buffet. <laughs> Pissed me off. I walk up there. You know you ain't supposed to stick your face right in the deck. Ooh, I felt bad. He was in a wheelchair. <laughs> oh, man. Believe me, I felt bad. Not as bad as I felt, though, when I pushed him out of the way. I'll tell you that. <laughs> Out of the way, roller boy. I'm about to make some bad decisions right here. <laughs> I love that Golden Corral. That's a good restaurant right there. Oh, that is good in there. They ought to have a scoring system, a Golden Corral, like they do in bowling, you know? You walk in there to eat, they put your name up on the TV screen and show everybody how much food you ate after 10 trips to the buffet. You can pick teams and compete with other fat folks in there. That'd be something. Hey, sweetheart, where's my stretch pants? It's league night at Golden Corral tonight. I seen a couple get engaged at the Golden Corral. <laughs> Hey, fellas, here's a tip. If you're going to ask your girl to marry you at a golden corral, get down on two knees and do it so she can't kick you in the nuts. <laughs> I was down in Branson. They got stuff down there, buffets. Holy smokes. They got an international buffet in Branson. It is crazy. They got food all the way from Memphis. Got a double-decker buffet. They got a double-decker, one of the world's largest buffets, double-decker, spiral staircase. All right, that's just what all us fat folks have been clamoring for right there. A buffet with a staircase. Oh, I'm gonna get some more of them donut holes. They're upstairs. You know what, I'm all right, I guess. I'll be all right. Stay down here, get some meatballs, put some powdered sugar on them. That's what I do right there. A lot of old folks down there in Branson riding them scooters down there. I find that crazy. These folks have lost their driver's license two decades ago, but they're going to go ahead and let them have motorized vehicles in a room full of pedestrians at the buffets down there. <laughs> Trying to get food. They're zipping by like it's a drive through I went up to get some potato salad. It was like I was in a live Frogger game all of a sudden. You know, I can't... got hit head on by some old dude trying to text and drive. <laughs> he trying to send a crock shot to Tinder, apparently. <laughs> I was uh, at a restaurant one time. You ever been to these restaurants and you go to the bathroom? It could be any restaurant, but you go to the bathroom and they go take a leak in there and they got a sign that all employees must wash hands. That scares the hell out of me right there. They need a sign to tell these folks to wash their hands? I mean, what the hell makes me wonder what kind of sign they got back in the kitchen we can not see back there? Don't snot in the coleslaw. Don't dip your scrotum in the salsa. Hey, that actually happened one time. That's a true story. You remember that story? A waiter was mad at a customer and dipped his scrotum in the salsa. Oh, that's why I always order the hot cheese dip. <laughs>